In a school, there are a total of 5,760 boys and girls. That means that the total number of boys and girls is 5,760. Now, there are 358 more girls than boys. How many boys are there in the school? So, let's draw a model representing this statement here. Right, the number of girls is 358 more than the number of boys. Alright, so these are the number of boys here. And these are the number of girls here. There are a total of 5,760 boys and girls. Alright, so all of this will add up to 5,760. So as you can see here, this two units and 358 is equal to 5,760. Let's write that down. Two units, all right, plus 358 people is equal to 5,760. So these two units here must be equal to 5,760 minus 358. Alright, so this here will work out to be, let's work it out here. Alright, 5760 minus 358. Alright, so 8 cannot be subtracted from 0, so we borrow from the tens place. We borrow one set of 10, and we bring one set of 10 here, so there's 10 ones here, 10 minus 8. There's 2, 5 minus 5 is 0, 7 minus 3 is 4, 5 minus nothing is just 5. So this is 5,402. So 5,402 is the value of these two units here. One unit has to be equal to 5,402 divided by 2. So let's work that out here. 5,402 divided by 2. Firstly, 2 times 2 is 4. 5 minus 4 is just 1. Let's bring 4 down here. So this is just 7 times 2 will give us 14. Alright. And we have 0 and a 2 here. So let's put a 0 and 1 times 2 is just 2 here. And we will get 2,701. So, one unit here is 2,701. This is also 2,701. So, there are 2,701 boys. Alright, so this here is our answer.